Sitting ever so peacefully on the rooftop of this Southwest Memphis home is one of nature's true beauties, a hawk. Within moments, this bird of prey was gone. There is irony in seeing this, as much the same happened the night before. Around 7 o'clock Wednesday night, Memphis police were called to Deerskin Drive inside the Harold E. Ford Senior Villas. Neighbors are telling us a 15-year-old boy was shot in the face. Much like the hawk we saw take flight, the gunman after the attack was gone. Neighbors say moments before the shooting, the teen was sitting on this transformer in the same spot where there's a rusted bullet hole. The victim later told detectives earlier in the day he was riding with someone in a stolen Acura SUV. After being dropped off, the same stolen vehicle returned. This time, someone was in the back seat who opened fire, hitting the teen in his right cheek and shoulder. A woman living in the area telling us off camera, this is why she does what she can to stay out of harm's way. Always be prepared to just walk away. It is clearly stated. However, we know of at least one gunman who was not focused on this sign that greets everyone coming into this community. This message, in fact, is similar to the one the Memphis mother we spoke with says she's always working to pass on, and that is to put the guns down in order to live to see another day. Hey, I wish they would just do like we did, just fight with this. Put the guns down and fight each other and be friends tomorrow. Tomorrow is today. The sound of gunfire overnight replaced by the chirping of birds and renewed hope things will get back to normal. Definitely. As the area is being cleaned up. In Southwest Memphis, Jarita Patterson, WREG, News Channel 3. At last check, police were still looking for the gunman and the Acura SUV. Call Crime Stoppers at 901-528-CASH if you have any information.